All right, right now we're on training room Gary's workbench and we're going to open up a package and let's see what's inside of this package. What we have here, I've ordered some kits. They're all on O scale. This is the first one. Let's move the box back so you can see these better. And I'll line them all up here. And we'll talk a little bit about them. This first one is uh, Lewis and Sons Manufacturing Company, J Bar Corporation. And the last one is Skyline Steel. All right, these are uh, cold bar models. Up here's the name of the company. And they're O scale. Let's take a peek on one of these. My plan is to turn these into flat buildings for one of my winter projects. I need some more flats. But let's just take a look at this and see how these come to the modeler. All right, there we go. There's the inside. Complete uh, detailed directions. Here's some of the wall panels. And this is what I hope to build this winter and turn them into uh, flats. All right, this is an example of buildings made into flats. So the models we just looked at are going to turn into flats along a wall, paint some clouds next to them, and it looks something like this here. And you can also notice there's a lot of detail in the windows in this bag. Here's all the windows and detail parts. So I think this is going to be a good kit. Looks like it's well put together. And it has the detail plans and a lot of the details it's going to take to build this kit. Now one thing about these uh, Colbert models, which is interesting, is uh, if you can see down here, they're all made in the United States, which is a good thing from from our standpoint of view, otherwise it's having to be a foreign country made in America. This last one here is called Skyline Steel. And here's the directions for a Skyline Steel. So over and over, I think you know these are gonna be good kits if I make them flats or make them full structures. It'll make for a nice project on a winter night. Now down below I'll put under the screen here, I'll put down a link to uh, Colbert Models. I bought these on, on, on their fall sale. They were 50% off. So if you look at their webpage and kind of go through it, you'll see at least four models marked half price. All right, when it comes to the supplies, I like using uh, Tester's uh, Dull Coat. Take some of the sheen of the plastic. I also use epoxies, like you see here. And of course, the basic testers plastic cement, along with different varieties of super glue, and then a variety of paints from those big box paint stores to help get the, the mortar and Whatever colors you want to get, any color you want, you can get from these big box art stores. 
So this concludes our look at these new models for the layout. They're all made in America from the Cobra Model Company and they're all O scale. That's it. This is Trainroom Gary saying thanks for watching. Please rate, subscribe, and comment.